Hello and welcome to a new video of Cycle Support Campus. Today we are going to do it yourself. Install a normal indoor access point in an outdoor environment using the Cycle Auto Enclosure. How this works, I show you in this video. Normally we install this device outdoor, but because of the weather conditions outside at the moment I've prepared it already inside. So to install the device on the wall you find a position where it's a little bit sheltered, maybe under the roof or not exposed to the sunlight every day because the device is IP44 waterproof, but if the weather conditions impact to this device too much it could mean that the access point inside can be damaged. So the really uh, position is a little bit in the shadow and not directly exposed to water. We install the device on the wall using a scale and then you can fix the positions here so that the device is uh, tied to the wall. Then you, uh, fitten, you put the fittings in the hole so that there's no uh, option to get water from the back side into the device. Then we take the cable on the cable there's a fitting that comes with the uh, set. You put the cable through the hole and push the fitting tight into the hole. Then you can connect the access point on the LAN cable side. Put the wire correct and then install the device. Like this. At the end, you just put a cover on it. Make sure the lip is tight around the bottom of the device. And then you can screw it together using the two little screws that are also in the accessory of the device. That's all for the wall mounting. So the outdoor enclosure is made for round access point like the NWA 5123AC but we also have a WAX610D which use a square mount pla mounting plate. For this we have to modify the enclosure a little bit by using the original plate and the screws that come with the device and then you just fix the mounting plate three centimeters down the edge of the original plate and screw the device mounting plate tight to the back side. Make sure that the screws that come out on the back side are not hurting your finger. After you have tied up the bottom, make sure that the lips are also sealed down in the bottom of the device so that water cannot run inside. So this device also can be mounted on a pole, in the pole position. Uh, for that you just prepare to close the holes with the fittings that were delivered with the housing. And then you have the opportunity to mount the pole set on these two edges at the, at the back side of the device. You just complete it like shown in before with the device and the cabling close it tight and then we show you how to mount it on the pole mounting kit. Complete the back plate of the outdoor enclosure with the black fittings and then you can install the access point using the LAN cable with the fitting through the hole of the bottom. Install the access point and click it tight to the back plate. Then you can close the housing, make sure the lips are tight and install the screws on the bottom of the housing to fix the outdoor enclosure. Now we install the outdoor enclosure to the ankle using the lashes with nuts and plates. The pole mounting kit consists of all parts of metal shown in this video. After you screwed on the nuts tightly, we install the arm that is used for pole mounting. Use the screws and the nuts to tighten the arm. After that we use the claws to install the complete set to a pole. After we completed the set to the pole, you can use the outdoor enclosure bottom plate, screw it tight with the bottom screws, 
make sure that no water can go inside. Finally, you fix the position of the set and tight up all screws. So we're at the end of our do-it-yourself video how to install the outdoor enclosure for Zyxel access points. I hope you liked the video. Like us with thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss a new upload of the channel. Thank you very much for watching. Have a nice day. We're Zyxel and we're your networking ally.